Jackson County Jail will see big changes after years of criticism on how things were being run. And the director of corrections, Joe Piccinini, just resigned. 41 Action News anchor Cynthia Newsom is breaking down what this means. She's live at the jail right now. Cynthia. Yeah, the search begins right now for a brand new Jackson County corrections director. Uh, the former director, Joe Piccinini, resigned earlier this week. Uh, Frank White, the Jackson County executive, said that today he praised uh, Piccinini and said he did not pressure him to resign. This is the latest in a long line of serious problems at the Jackson County Jail. The FBI has raided the jail. Some guards were criminally charged. Some inmates have filed lawsuits claiming they were sexually assaulted. And some guards have been beaten in the jail. Studies have determined the jail is overcrowded, understaffed, and dangerous. And all of that happened under the leadership of Joe Piccinini, who resigned earlier this week. Well, Joe actually came to me, and uh, he just didn't want to be... Um... He, he really felt that uh, uh, he just didn't want to be in a position where things just weren't getting done. And he felt it was be best in, the be in his best interest and the best interest of the county that, that we look for new leadership going forward. Uh, Diana Turner uh, will be the new acting corrections director at the Jackson County Detention Center. She said right now they are 44 jailers short of what they need to staff a facility of 900 inmates. One jailer is still out on medical leave after he was beaten last month. We are doing what we can, um, evaluating each shift, shift by shift to do what we can to get more staff into that particular section of the facility. Now, Turner explains there's really not much that she can do to improve safety because of how the detention center is constructed, how it's built. There's a committee right now of citizens and uh, politicians that are reviewing reports and also getting public input to determine if we need to build a new Jackson County Detention Center or just rebuild this one, refinish this one, renovate it. Cynthia Newsom, 41 Action News.